Hi guys, welcome back to another travel vlog. We are spending 48 hours in Liverpool. <laughs> yes, so it's our anniversary today. I've been with this gorgeous man, the light of my life for 12 years today. Someone's got to do it, isn't they? 12 years. With that beard. Mm. Oh, it wasn't always a beard. No, it wasn't always a beard. No, it? it was a chin beard once upon a time. <laughs> a chin beard. And then I got a goatee at one point, and then it's trim beard, and then one day I thought, fuck okay, it, I'm not shaving. Little history about the beard. We're all packed up. We haven't been to Liverpool in years, yeah. and it, it, it used to be like a, a yearly thing for us. It used to be our favourite city before we started exploring. It is still up there yeah. as a favourite city. Do, we do like it, we just haven't been for a while. So we're booked into a, a couple of places for drinks tonight and mm. we're also booked in at the Smuggler's Cove. Pirate themed oh, it's, restaurants it's and cocktails. So good. It's, it's on cool. It's on the Albert Docks, which is our little favourite place within Liverpool. So we don't really have many plans. No, I think we're just gonna do a wander around, a bit of shopping. Yeah. We might, might do a museum, maybe. Maybe. Um, so we're just gonna give you a rough overview of Liverpool, really. We're gonna go get some breakfast now because we're starving yeah I don't know and we're, we're late on. yeah we're a little bit late we wanted to be on the road for half eight yeah um so probably mackies i guess i don't know what do you feel like uh, literally just anything probably a mackies okay yeah so mackies Let, let's go I'm not freezing. He hasn't bought a jumper it's with him. I didn't think it'd be that cold. I know it's January, but I didn't think it'd be that cold. Oh, I can grab a hoodie from Primark if I'm desperate. We are up north, so we have arrived. Mm -hmm. We've just paid £5 for an hour in the car park. <laughs> yep, because we weren't told that for oh. 1 o'clock you have to pay for parking. Yeah. And we're here an hour early, so we have to pay £5 for an hour. £5 for an hour. I'm a little bit annoyed that the hotels didn't state that before we arrived. But... Or at least like did £2.50. But no, we've got the full charge of the day even though we get free parking from one. <laughs> and it's now 12, but never mind. Never mind, we, we, we're gonna just let that slide. We're gonna go and try and find a toilet because we're desperate for a week. Mm. Um, a lot has changed. Like, yeah, a lot, lot of city, buildings gone up. Yeah, a lot of buildings have gone up. So. Very different. Um, I think the plan is we're just going to walk through the city. I want to go to the cabin club. Yeah, to go and, shopping, I think. Yeah, just a, a little mosey around. Yeah. Let's go for a little wonder. Wandering by shops, and we may have found an Achilles heel. Oh, no, there's one there. there is, there it is. First shop we've seen. <laughs> and there's a million loud flies and geek stuff. Oh, blue. That's gone. Can we go in? Do you want to go in? Yeah. <laughs> You didn't buy then, did you? I perused. I'm going to see how it is tomorrow once I've spent my money today. See how much I've got left because I did not budget for another lounge fly. <laughs> I don't need another lounge fly, but. Trick yourself. I bought something. Not for yourself, but it isn't for me. No. It's for my best mate it's his birthday. That I missed because I had COVID. So we found another Jimmy's, one that we found in York. Uh, so it don't look like it's open yet. 
talk about later. Yeah. So do you want to wander around this bit? Uh, yeah, I don't think we've wandered on there before, have we? No, I think it takes you into the city bit. Right, let's do it then. Here. I'd say that eight, nine times since we've been together. We've never ventured down like this part. I don't know where we're at. No. Uh, Concert Street. It's just massive, like, it's outdoor just loads, areas. Yeah, loads of food, like out eateries and everything. Just so much to choose from. It's a bit early, but I really want to go to the drinking place. That's why I want to say go to the cabin club. But but we'll, go, we'll go down there. We'll end it up. We'll come back here later. Okay. And she's found a cat, Cass. No. Oh, that's a shame. No, you can't see them. But just know they're in there. Three floors of cats though. <laughs> Go to sweet shop. Go and have a look. Have a look. We'll have a look, we'll have a look. Where the president couldn't That is a proper old school pub. That, that that's going to be a commoner's pub. If we go in there, we're going to get looks. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Can't go in there. It's closed at the moment. Actually, it looks closed. Full stop. Oh, Can't be. It's an open. <laughs> it doesn't look properly open. Uh, right, well, we'll have to come back later and see. Is that the 5 for 30 one? No, it's the quarter past 10. Okay, well, yeah. fingers crossed it'll be open then. Oh, it opens at 5. Okay. That's why. Okay. <sighs> at least you know where it is. We know where it is, and then we'll have to go down to the Alchemist as well. Yes. But we're going to Cabin Club first because it's on the way. Yes.
so if you look here on the left guys this is the cavern club it looks like oh yeah you got a turtle bay right next to it as well cavern restaurant across the bay but the club is there Is it busy or is it quiet? Is that the river down there? Yeah. Yeah. Just uh, checking out tonight. I don't know if anyone else is like this, but whenever I go somewhere and I've got somewhere booked and I don't know specifically where it is, I have to go and see it before the booking. <laughs> Just so I know where it the is. Plan. I think it's anxiety, but. Yeah. Not really that far, and it, looks it does. It does look really pretty cool, actually. Yeah, cool. I'm looking forward to that. So, I think we're gonna get what another drink before checking in. We're gonna go to the other cabin. Um, yeah, get another drink because it is, you know, anniversary time. Um, <coughs> get another drink. It doesn't take us long to get ready because we're literally just getting dressed. We're booked in there for 5:30. It's now. Well, it's only ten past two, um, so we'll go to the other cavern, have another drink, yeah. have a little wander, go and check in, get ready, and then night on the table. Get on it. It's a hard day's night hotel, isn't it? Oh yeah, look, John. Yeah, all, all down the, all four of them, are all the way down. Oh yeah. You ever noticed that before? No, because I don't think I've walked down this bit. Let's go and have a look at the front of the hotel. Okay. Hard Days Night Hotel. I got a tip bucket. That's right, hashtag it. I can't believe I'm charging that. I don't know. Saying that, I bet they struggle. Yeah, maybe. Do you like it in here? I do. 
can't see the traffic for it now, though. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, do you not know that? <laughs> but yeah, it goes all the way round. This was not here last time. Yeah, it was. Okay. Yeah, I think it just closed off. I think that's where the big people go. <laughs> That's going to take off. What you doing? Oh yeah. Yeah. <sighs> what are we doing now? Heading back to the hotel. Spruce up. Here we first. You alright? Go wear mask. Bloody hell. It's been a while. This is the liner. Mm. It's been a while. Been a while. Do you uh, do you want to do your, your your standard room tour? Well, you can follow me around this time. Can we'll, I? We'll do a new one. Okay. So we're quite ple pleasantly surprised that we've got a king bed. I did not pay for that. So this room, before we go into it, was fifty-two pound for one night with breakfast. Bargain. So we've got plenty of storage. Hangers, safe. Not that we ever use safe, but plenty of room. Plenty of room storage. So we'll go and have a look at the bathroom first. Now, very clean. Very clean. Got a bag. Very clean. Very clean, people. Got a bag. All our towels here. So loads of towels. Nice vanity area. Nice. Toilet roll and stuff. Plenty of room. Shitter. Shitter, you got to have a shitter. Well, yeah, it's the minimal I expect. Shower cap. Oh, nice. I don't know what make that is. Prezia. But very nice, very nice, very clean, very clean. It's always good to have a bath. Not that we're here for a bath. I had time for a bath, I'd have one. But we love this hotel because it's just so convenient. It's so <coughs> convenient. And it's lovely, it's all nautical, nautical. so it's, that's perfect for us. So we've got a nice little desk area. Hair dryer, thank hair, God. Hair dryer for your beard. Um, nice getting ready area. There's nothing in the mini bar, but we don't need that. Little TV, but we're not going to watch Mo We'll watch it when we come home and go to bed when we're a bit tipsy later. Mm. Tea and coffee facilities. Some little green teas if you're into that. Mm -hmm. Massive bed. I can't even get it in one shot. <laughs> oh, it's really comfy as well, actually. <laughs> Massive bed. As you can see, there's what, big. six pillows there. So it's a lot. All good in the hood. Um, really nicely decorated. Mm. Nice and oh, clean. Oh, no. Is it that one? 
Hey, there we go. Hey, there we go. Better. So yeah, and we overlooked a couple of chairs. Chairs. We overlooked the train station, which you know us, we're train geeks. I don't think we've ever overlooked the train station before. I don't before. think we have. We've always looked frontwards. Mm. Then that's the police depot there, which yeah. I wish wasn't there, but never mind. Where else? There's but, the old, the old bill. But yeah, you can hear the trains in the station. You can see them. Lovely room. And our breakfast is at nine tomorrow. So yeah, fifty-two pound. Hmm. So we're gonna get a bit rested now. I'm gonna have a shower because I've got that city sweat on me. Um, ready for the festivities tonight. So we've got, as we've shown you, we've got the Alchemist, we've got Smuggler's Cove for dinner and drinks, and then we've got Present Company later on. And we'll see if we can go to other places as well, but those are the main three that we're booked into. So, yeah, let's let's have a bit of a rest. I just like wearing the same fucking outfit, don't I? It's a good it's outfit. It's comfy. I got my eating pants on. It's a good outfit. So your white boots. Oh yeah, I love my white boots. They're just so comfy. Three pound Primark. Love I've just gone for my standard black skinny jeans and me maroon t-shirt. Mm. No, nothing special. Maroon. Maroon. Just gone five o'clock now. We're running a little bit late. Um, so we've got a scoot on down to the Alchemist. Yes. Um, which I'm very excited about because it's all very like chemistry based um, cocktails. Um, so, and then like once we're done with that obviously we'll go into Smuggler's Clovis down on the upper docks so instead of going through the town what we're going to do is go through the cavern strip again yeah because hopefully like they'll all be done up in lights and there'll be loads of music and everything so if that's the case then we'll you know we're to show you at night time um, but also when we go to the Albert docks obviously it'll be night time as well so we are going to go back there tomorrow to show you it in the daylight as well yeah but it's very pretty at night as well Absolutely. so we'll show it you at night time as well but we better get let's, going let's go get some chemistry drinks yeah <laughs> What do you think of the place anyway? Really nice. It's nice, isn't it? I like behind the bar it's all like got artwork. Yeah, and um, I'll try and get a decent shot of the bar on the way out. You're just bubbling away. I Look at that. That is cool. Alright, let's calm down a bit now. <laughs> Cheers. Bubbling away. It has got glitter in it. Has it? Got in it. Here it go. Calm down now. It's settled. It's settled. It's really nice. It's strong. It's nice though. Thank you. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's a pot of the So it's going to bubble away. What the hell, Mum? That's cool. Yeah. <laughs> No, it's not. It's cool. Yeah, it's not. It's like <laughs> Oh, yeah. It's like incense. Yeah. Brilliant. Thank you very much.
That's so A lovely couple of drinkies. Yeah. Um, I don't think we've ever like reviewed just drinks before, but yeah. maybe we'll do it a little bit more often when there's like theatrical stuff like that. Yes. Like, if it's just a regular drink, then obviously I'm not going to bother, but with something like that, I think it deserves to have its own review. So Kerry was our server, and she was amazing. <laughs> you, you are paying for the theatrical the drinks of it. You Whoa. really are. But it's all part of the fun. You don't get it every day, so... What was the bill? Under 40 quid? It was under 40 quid. For so, four yeah, drinks. so you do, you do pay you know, a bit more th for the well, theatrics no, for of it. Four drinks, that's a £10 cocktail. Yeah, true. So, it's bog standard. Love the really. theatrics, this is pretty decent, to be honest. So, in, in all honesty, I give it a five star. I think it was really, yeah, really fun. Star. It's yeah. worth going there for a laugh. And like, if the you're doing vlogging, the, the vibe's lovely. awesome. Yeah. yeah. Worth and it. the people are lovely as well. So, um, yeah, we're now going to wander on down to Smuggler's Cove. So exciting. Uh, and then we're gonna we're actually gonna go through the cavern as well and show you that in the dark. Yes. <laughs>
Are you ready for pirate theme? I am ready for pirate theme. So, chicken wings and calamari. Look. Looking forward to your calamari. I am. I'm starving. I'm ravenous. I've only had breakfast. I had anything else today. Breakfast and quite a lot of that now. So. Yeah. Just soak it up. Sarah has got herself a burger, but it comes in a nice little swashle bucket. I know, but it comes in a swashel bucket. I didn't know that they were doing um, Sunday roast today. But I get a hanging kebab. So that hangs all the way down to your chips. And then you pour that in, which I'm about to do. It's like garlic. Pour that in like that. That's it. There you go. That's what you want. Look at that. Yeah, all the way down. How about that? Ready? Smuggler's Cove. Yes. I was a little bit disappointed. Yeah, you were, weren't you? Yeah. Uh, we, th we think it may have changed hands at some point. Yeah, it's changed hands. There's Sunday menu on, which was not the best if you don't want a roast dinner. I don't know whether that was the full menu or whether it was a reduced menu because it no, was Sunday. No, it's the full menu there. It's got all the stuff on there. So that I really... Yeah. So, so it's just menu. unfortunately we kept the wrong time. But I had a, a burger. It was standard. It was standard. Yeah, fortunately. Absolute standard. I'd give it a three out of five. Halloumi you had? No, I didn't have halloumi. I had calamari. Calamari, that's it. Calamari's lovely. Yeah. Um, and the, drinks the wings were really nice I had, and the lamp off the hang bath I thought was really, really nice. But yeah, it's just a burger view. Yeah, and um, I've got an ice pick migraine. Yeah, but it's not their <laughs> No, it's not their fault. I'm just, it's starting a little bit, so we're just going to... Power on three. Um, yeah, so ratings out of five overall, really. Three out of five, unfortunately. Uh, I'm going to give mine a four out of five. Um, I, I've, I was a little bit annoyed that we got reduced menu, but I suppose it is Sunday, but I still, I still thought the food was really, really nice. So, yeah. That I had. So, oh, it's so um, we're going to wander back up to the cabin quarter, I think, and see if we can get in for just a, a sneaky drink um, before we go to present company, mm -hmm. because we finished a bit early at Smuggler's yeah, Cove. We did. It was quite quiet, so we're going to go and have a wonder.
karaoke in there at all. Yeah, but YouTube is where we found them. Yeah, um, and they review food and drinks um, in different locations, different cities, um, and they're 24 hours in Liverpool. They came here. Um, so this is Top Jewel Racing. Cheers, all that. Link in description. It does look right, doesn't it? Yeah, it's Sheetra, isn't it? Ready for bed? Mm. Come on then. Yep, so have I. Have ya? Yep. <laughs> Good driver. Stop it. So we are back in the hotel. Yes. It has been a long day. What yeah, time is it now? Past 11. About quarter past 11. Yeah, I've been awake since quarter past five. Because I was excited. But my hair's gone really flat. Mine has as well, actually. But yeah, I've had a lovely evening. It's really nice. Really yeah. nice. Except for the Sergeant Pepper's place where it was just full of really young people that were absolutely wasted. Yeah, we didn't stay in there long. I felt very uncomfortable and I had a woman pinch my ass, which I really did not appreciate. Mm. I felt very uncomfortable. Don't do that, ladies. And men. You think you're being cool. You're not being cool. You're, not you're being, being cool. an arsehole. You're being an arsehole. <laughs> Don't do that. So yeah, we got... Oh, I downed my drink and we went Yeah, out. we got out of there quick. Um, but the present company... Yeah, it was nice, wasn't it? It was. Really chilled vibe. Just nice chill. The bartender was lovely. Like, yeah, really attentive. Just kept filling up the water, asking how we were, and just really, really friendly, really chilled, really quiet. 
and we're getting to that age now where it's like I like a cocktail bar and it's quiet. Yeah, don't get me wrong. I like a bit of music. I like a lot of people. The good vibe. But I want to be able to talk to people. Yeah. I don't want the. Dun, 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 dun. Oh yeah, we've seen. I, I mean, could, I can't believe honestly, it. Honestly, like, we went to another pub after the Sergeant Pepper place, and it was really nice. It was really like. Really I, cool. It was an Irish pub. Yeah, it was just this kid that was like eighteen years old was playing acoustic guitar and did really well. But opposite it, there was just this. Dun, 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 just constantly. And, like, and that was at like nine o'clock. Yeah. And it's like it's nine o'clock on a Sunday evening. I was like, Jesus, like, I don't even. And want it was to do... sweaty in there. You could see all, all steamed up and want... like all these young girls absolutely twatted. I don't even want to do that at ten o'clock on a Friday night, let alone <laughs> nine o'clock on a Sunday. Fuck that. And it's just city life, though, isn't it? It's like it's 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 still going on when we're walking home. It's just like live music everywhere. I think we just underest. I think we underestimate it so much because we live in a small town. Yeah. When we go to big cities and it's uh, it's so buzzing on a Sunday night or a night that's not a Friday or a Saturday, it's just yeah. it, it still baffles us. It's a bit jarring, isn't it? Yeah, it's like, like, haven't you got what? work? Yeah, I always think <laughs> that. It's like, have you not got work in the morning? We can't all be off. We can't all be having a Monday <laughs> off. But yeah, we're gonna we're gonna sign off for for this evening. Yes, we've got a busy old day tomorrow. We've got the breakfast here, which is a bang on breakfast. It is a buffet breakfast. Here is where we're my mind. This is where I went in the back. Um, yes, and then um, we're thinking of going down to the Maritime Museum, which is down mm -hmm. at the Albert Docks. We've done it before. Um, really, you know what we're like with our history. Yeah, nice really book. good, free well. museum. Bit shopping. Um, have a look around the Albert Docks at Docks. Albert Docks in the light. And then we were going to go to the Baltic Triangle, but I don't think it's open on the Monday. Yeah, and if it is, I don't think we're going to get time to get up there because it is a little bit, it's like fifth, ten minutes out of the way from the centre so we'd have to get a taxi up there and back yeah. and stuff. So we're going to try a new place hopefully tomorrow yes. called the Duke Street Market which is another like food Big vendor food market. place. We're going to have a, a little meet up there see if we could get some lunch up there but for tonight we're signing off. Don't know if this is going to be the whole video. We're halfway through. <laughs> Commercial break. <laughs> Commercial break. <laughs> but uh, we'll see you in the morning. Bye. Bye night.